Hello everyone, Manface is here, and Far Harbor is upon us. The DLC trailer was released today, and the DLC will drop on Thursday, May 19th on all platforms. Looks to be sprawling new lands containing some dank and dark environments that somewhat remind me of the pit mixed with Point Lookout from Fallout 3. I really like the spooky atmosphere the DLC is trying to convey, something I feel Fallout 4 was lacking significantly. Looks like there will be some new companions, but I also see Nick there, which makes me wonder. Normally you can't bring companions on the DLC, so I'm curious of the implications of having Nick there. Also, I hope that maybe we can help Nick out, maybe get him some new skin or something. The trailer seems to be only a teaser, but it did reveal some key information. Namely, we got some new monsters. Right off the bat, Geckos from New Vegas. I know it was a little bitty shot of it, but I mean, you can't miss that silhouette. I saw some things that kind of look like lantern fish, and I'm guessing that they're really there to catch you while you're walking through the water if you're not paying attention to the glow. So maybe walking at night might be a little bit better than walking in the daytime if you're having to travel through the water. Mantises, although I don't think they're called mantises, but mantises from New Vegas, although they are considerably larger and more scary looking, but hey, I like that. And one more, it kind of looks like a Chorus or a Chorus Reaper from Skyrim, if you know what I'm talking about. Uh, one of the Falmer pets, you know, like the heavily armored slug looking thing. So I'm getting some heavy, heavy New Vegas nostalgia from this trailer. And that's really getting me hyped up. So for new weapons and armor, I did see some new weapons. I saw like a fishing hook. I believe that there's a couple of new guns, maybe two or three. But namely, I want to talk about are the armors I saw. Uh... <laughs> That rickety looking scuba suit looks pretty cool. I really hope it works. Uh, I don't see why it wouldn't. I mean, there was rebreather in New Vegas, so you just can't take a step back. I want to take a step forward. Let's get power armor in the water. Let's make it happen. Now, I also saw some combat armor that looked pretty damn impressive. I like the shape of it. I like that it had subtle hints of glow, and it was really... Uh, raw looking and just tough you know i guess it reflects the environment that it came from it just looks pretty badass and then you know as always with these fallout trailers uh it's only really scratching the surface of the content so i'm sure there's tons of stuff that we haven't even seen yet so you can go ahead and call me a fanboy because i'm definitely excited for the new gritty look of the far harbor dlc interesting locations and npcs look to give tons of hours of enjoyment not to mention the return of some of my favorite New Vegas enemies, this DLC looks promising. But what do you guys think? Put it in the comments. And as always, thanks for watching everyone. Take care.